Hello, I'm the Zed and today I will show you how to install the VHBL for the Pharma 2.12. First, um, I will upload the save game files for the VHBL to Zload pretty soon, after Vololo uploaded it to his page. But since we're on my page, let's download the 138 menu. It's a very nice menu and it's highly recommended to use it with the new VHBL, especially since Farmer 2.10. Download file, save. Then we have to go into the downloads folder. There we have the menu, and I've already got the VHBL files for the American exploit. The files for the European exploit will be released with the ones of the American. Okay, next we have to go into the save data folder. For me it's a library, documents, PS Vita, save data, then a weird bunch of numbers and letters, which has something to do with my PSN account, and in there we can put save games. Like this, for example, a save game of Final Fantasy. Not really necessary, just an example. Then we will open the zip file, and in there is an npass which we will drag and drop into this folder. So we have the exploit save game to this folder. In there are a bunch of files which we should not re um, rename. We shouldn't touch these files at all. Then we can close this one. Next is something I highly recommend. Use the 138 menu. It's a brand new shining menu for the VHBL and it's saves of some things that are fixed since firmware 2.10. It's also pretty easy to install. Just go into this folder and then drag and drop these five files into the exploit save game folder. Um, it will ask to overwrite the ebird.pbp file. Just do it, it's no problem. Okay, that's pretty much everything you have to do. Now we go to the PS Vita and transfer in this step we will transfer the, f the safe data we just put in onto our PS Vita. At first I'm running firmware 2.12, then it's the most recent firmware yet, and then I will go to the content manager app. Dark. Okay, now we will go to PC, Applications, PSP slash others, and copy the file. Pretty easy, it will copy every file, so you just have to copy this and then we can run the game. Okay, now we launch the game. and go to high scores. Then we we'll press X and the screen will flash a few times. Then it will load the half byte loader and since we've added the 138 menu it will also load the 138 menu. In there we have the option to install. I will show you in the next video how to install homebrews. Then we have the option to launch homebrews. And then we have settings for having um, English, Espan Spanish, French or German menu. In there we can, if I change this mode to accurate, it won't say Final Fantasy in Diablo, it will say what's inside of the install zip, but more about this in the next video. This was just how to install the HBL.